Guys, I will show you how to make this box with handle, how to take an exact measurement, and how to assemble it. The size of this box is 6 inches, the length, then the width is 4 inches, and the height is 2 inches. You can also make with your own measurement. For example, you want it to be 12 inches by 5 inches by 5 inches. You can do it as long as you know how to take an exact measurement and how to assemble it, which I am going to show it in this video. This should be the cutout of this box. This should be the physical appearance before you assemble the box. How to do it? Let's start. The first thing you are going to measure is from the edge of your board, you measure one inch. I already made it. And then next will be the length of the box. The length of the box that I'm going to make is six inches so I will measure six inches and next will be the width of the box which is four inches then measure six inches again and then the width that is four inches Also here, so one inch, and then six inches, then four inches, then another six inches, and another four. And then connect it to make a line. This will be the guide in cutting the board next to measure is the vertical side we have finished with the horizontal side now you have to start from here from the bottom first measurement will be two inches since the height of the box that i will be making is two inches so i will measure from the bottom or from the edge of the board I will measure two inches first is two inches then another two inches and another two inches so one two three you have to measure three two inches and the next one we have to measure 4.5 centimeters do not get the exactly two inches we have to make it is shorter than two inches and after that another two inches okay. then on the other side so we can connect the line two inches two inches two inches then 4.5 I will show you why this is only 4.5 centimeters. Next is 2 inches. Okay. It's done. We can start connecting and creating a line. Okay, next is I will measure from here a 2 inches two inches then from here 
another 2 inches. Okay guys, we are going to cut this one or we are going to remove this portion. Then, another in the middle of in the middle or yeah in the middle of the width which is four inches so you have to get the two inches okay in the middle of the width you have to create a line from here up to here okay then We have to cut it. Okay. <clears throat> so we will be removing this, this, and this the wheel and this is also the wheel so we will do the same but opposite okay for you not to be confused i will try to remove the line yeah. meaning this will be removed later we will cut that one and then here we are going to measure two inches and two inches you can uh, get okay. then the two inches two inches to connect the line this one and this one okay so we will be removing this and we will be removing this okay next is the top part we have to get the center again from this part and also from this part we will put an extra a little bit higher then get the center and from the center you get at least 1 cm and connect this to this one and connect this to this one okay and this will be cut this will be cut this will be cut then we will make the hole there we are going to insert where we are going to insert the holder we will do the same here so we will adjust the height to one half inch to half inch okay and then get the center and okay and then connect to the corner we will cut this, we will cut this, and we will cut this. And from the middle of this, we are going to make a hole. Where we are going to insert the holder. Okay. Next will be the handle. In the handle, we are going to get half inch from this line half inch and also half inch from this line and 
here also so we can connect the line half inch and half inch connect and then connect and then from here we will get another half inch and we will get the center three so this is six inches yung length na is six inches we will get the three inches that is the middle of the center then we will get from from this line we will get one inch another one inch from here okay and you connect this line to this one that is now the handle okay that's now the handle and then we will make the hole we will make the hole where we are going to insert our fingers to carry this box so I got 1.5 and 1.5 from here so the same thing we'll get 1.5 and 1.5 inches from here then we took one half inch from here going there half inch from here also half inch or one inch I mean one inch so that will now be the hole okay same thing we will do here Now we can start cutting, guys.
Okay guys, now this is the final cutout. See that? Okay, that's it. Next thing is we're going to score to help us in folding and assembling the box. I will be needing this as my scooter. The other side. Just follow the line that we have created a while ago. Follow that line. Okay. No need to score for this line because we are not going to fold it. Okay. I can use a double sided tape for that part here. Okay. We already have it. See this? Mm. Okay. We can assemble it now by insert. This is the bottom part. Okay. Assemble it. Do like this. it now okay now we have it diba oh fine good now we already have the this will be the inside box okay then start folding it folding it Okay, can insert it here, okay, and we can insert it here, okay, now we have the box, okay, now it's done. You have the box with the holder. If you want to make it curve, you can do it. Just put, just cut a little bit. Okay, like that. And like that one. 